Welcome to Falcons Franchise. As we start off this episode with a little bit of housekeeping to do. A little bit of housekeeping. And <laughs> that's size. I, I don't know why that made me laugh. It's just so stupid. Anyway, we've seen trades for offensive linemen before like that. If you look at Jimmy Graham for... Uh, wow. Max... Why can I not remember his name? Seahawks center, Max Unger. That's odd. Usually I don't blank like that. Probably some oh, classic me. Just got a drink. I'm an alcoholic. <laughs> if I laugh about it, it's not a joke. I mean, it makes it whatever. Uh, I'm not. Don't don't worry about me. This is a team that can certainly make the playoffs. Made it last year at four and four. Please. Made it last year at eight and eight. Oh, actually, well, did the Patriots win that game or no? And Tom Brady retires. Hold on. Because sometimes it's flipped, but maybe the maybe the Patriots won that. They sure did. 38-14. So Tom Brady goes to play his old team, the Patriots. The Patriots beat him, said, hey, you made the wrong decision. And he retires in protest. I could see it. I could see it. Aries Nobles, interesting name. I wonder if he knows Barnes. And then Jerry Smith. Looks good as well. Also, by the way, I hate when people call it Barnes and Nobles. It's Barnes and Noble. Read. Get a pair of glasses or something. I don't know. I've been holding on to that one for a while. I'm upset about it. And then Matt Paradis. I think I can let him walk at 33. My phone dropped. It's a bad day. I don't mean to stun on you guys, by the way, like bragging that I have a phone. I know it, most people don't have phones in 2020. Uh, actually, everyone has a phone. Yeah, I know. You are the only one who didn't get it. This Hall of Famer holds a record for most rushing yards in a season by a rookie. I, like the first name that popped into my head was Gail Sayers. Could this be OJ? Shout out OJ. Better player on the field than off it. I hope. Uh, man, allegedly, if the glove don't fit, you must acquit or something like that, right? This Hall of Famer holds the record for most rushing yards this season by a rookie. Hall of Famer. Gail Sayers is in the Hall of Fame. OJ's got to be in the Hall of Fame. Probably a couple Hall of Fames. Hall of Fame of murderers, too. Greg Fox. Fal Falcon. Falcon Punch. I don't know how to say that. Fa Falkies. The Atlanta Falcons, and of course, I really want to focus on Pete Riley. Slippery Pete, let's get him. Now, a huge staple of NCAA 14, of course, is recruiting. Since we're not a very good team, I don't know if you guys have ever heard of the Ozark State Outlaws. Trust me, you will. We're not going to be creating any prospects. We're going to skip straight to recruiting, and we'll see what type of players we might be able to lure. Because I, I won't even say what players will be able to bring in because we're really luring them to our location here in the Ozarks. No one <laughs> wants to come here. And we have to trick them. We got to do maybe a little Bill Cosby action, a little bit of, you know, a little bit of things here and there that maybe is not so great. More like, you know, from a moral standpoint. But we're going to get the job done. Of course, Hendon Hooker would be banned because... I don't know if you guys know about hookers and blow. No, that's those are linked though. Um, Hendon Hooker, actually, in more ways than one. Here's what I'm gonna tell you though. If I get back up there, I'm gonna do the beds again. That's what. That's the promise that I can make you guys. I will. I will bounce on the beds again. <laughs> I sound like a bad kid right now. I'm gonna fucking bounce on that bed again. I'm not going to sleep, baby. And this is by far the most insane story I have ever seen in Madden history. What are we doing here? Left outside linebacker Arville Sickle Stalin sits out offseason with injury. Left end Demir Hammer Stalin impresses but coaches struggle with translation with brother gone. Madden 25, Hammer and Sickle, clearly communist Soviet Russia, USSR, Madden 25 took Joseph Stalin, 
who, and this sparked debate on Twitter about how great of a guy Joseph Stalin is, apparently, didn't really expect to get into an argument with Joseph Stalin sympathizers in 2023, but here we are. It's Twitter. I should have guessed. Madden 25 took Joseph Stalin made a bloodline storyline? What is going on? And Demir Stalin can't even speak English. And you know, it's probably a good thing they didn't continue this into the next Madden, which was Madden 15, because you probably see like Hans and Friedrich Hitler running around trying to sack the quarterback with Blitzkrieg. But I'm, I'm sure the Stalin brothers are going to seize the means of production. And every time they're rushing after the quarterback, they're gonna, each going to get a half sack. So they share the credit. Probably works better in theory than in practice, if I had to bet. They're not slick. I know what they're doing. Miami's Leroy Lester, the next Ray Lewis, is a deadly middle linebacker? Really? I, I bet he is the next Ray Lewis, deadly. Is this one going to get away with murder, or is that unrelated? And Leroy's brother, Mo, isn't innocent in all this either, by the way. And then maybe my favorite name of the entire Madden 25 cycle, Mash Johnson. Oh, is that what you do when she doesn't text back? You just go, all right, plan B. I don't know. This, this guy's unbelievable. As you can see here, every team has fallen for cornerback Leon Sandcastle, an electric athlete who played who college snaps and is projected as a third rounder. So I read that as it is, says it is, and I, now I'm, I'm having a stroke like the game is, but no, you're not having a stroke. That's what that says. Leon Sandcastle, dot, 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 an electric athlete who played who college snaps and is projected as third rounder. It, who's writing this? They have the literary skills of Robert Frost. Truly inspiring stuff. We got Quinston St. Saint from Ramapo. <laughs> Someone said on Twitter, Street Saint. Yeah, that's what the ST stands for. From Ramapo College? Okay. Matito Young. I think that's illegal. Something I like about Clem McRae. No eyebrows on him. Just completely like shaved off. Love Keevan instead of Kevin, by the way. Keevan Labuanan. Labuanan. Not to be outdone by Leventrice Littlehead. And he looks like he's got a decent size head. 6'3", 205. And running back? 6'3", that's a rarity. FIU corner Nordley McLaughlin. That's a combination of just non-words or names together. There surely is not someone on the planet named Nordley. Damar Husband. I don't know why that's funny to me. 5'10", Delaware corner, white, honky, <laughs> Frederick O'Connor. Can I say that? I can say that. I'm white. Luhata Sonatus. That's a good one. But probably the most insane one we've ever seen. Wolverine Justice. This isn't a DC movie. Oregon middle linebacker Wolverine Justice. I know what you're thinking. Hall of Fame name? Well... 20 years into the future, he is a Hall of Famer. I just don't see a whole lot in Kyle Trask. He could end up being great. Anything could happen. Uh, if the queen had balls, she'd be king. And if the queen was alive, she'd be queen still. So like, I have no doubts if you have the different archetype and you have 89 speed out the gate, you can definitely run a lot faster than we're doing. But I feel like we're pretty much at the max potential for what you could do with 85 speed. Never mind! I just ran 417! What are you talking about? That's a record by a billion! <laughs> John Ross has the record at 422. I wish I could give you a tutorial on that. I have no idea how I just did that. 417. Unbelievable. I feel like we're gonna be as good as we can be. There's B. John Robinson. Hook him horns. As many of you guys know, I'm a Huge Texas Longhorns fan, or based on this route, I could say I'm a wheelie big Texas Longhorns fan. <laughs> Please don't leave the video. Yeah, the Saints defense there was abysmal. I mean, just, just terrible. They need to bring back Bounty Gate or something if they're going to have a chance in this game. No, I know that's a sore subject. I'm just joking. Unless. Is that Jawan Johnson, the actual Saint? I believe it is. Well, not like Mother Teresa or anything. You know, like, he plays on the Saints in real life. You got what I mean. I think everyone knew. Ball, why do we keep trying that? Because it's open? Yeah, it's, it's a good idea, maybe. But in practice, it doesn't work. The deep ball is communism. It sounds good until you realize it's never worked. And then that riles up the communists in my comments section, which you're like, there aren't any. And you'd be sh shocked. There are many. And there are you just don't know because of the Western world. And I'm like, joke's on you. I don't 
I don't care what you're saying. You're speaking to nobody. It's first and 10. I mean, we're in a good spot right now. 31-17. Are you fucking kidding me? Oh, my power didn't go out. It's had a power surge. And for the first time, it, well, it turned off the Xbox, funnily enough. But for the first time, I didn't lose my entire recording. I don't know. It just went, I, I don't know how much my reaction is going to be in there because when my monitor shuts off, it like freezes my camera. I'll leave it in. Uh, if I, if I swore, uh, sorry for swearing, right? You know, but, um, <laughs> uh, we'll see what that looks like, but we're going to have to jump back in here. Well, you can't put a timeout on Jimmy Gordon. Four touchdowns for Gordon. I mean, maybe this isn't a passing offense. We are getting into the goal line and we are pounding it in. Jimmy Gordon with four scores. Looking like Abe Lincoln, baby.